Happy Wednesday. Coming from Nyack, New York. As the hours melt into the days. Melt into the weeks. Melt into the months. We sit in our slumber. Into our cocoon. Waiting. Receiving the divine feminine energy. Letting go of our willingness to sometimes act without thinking, speaking without thinking. And if you're here today, say hello so I can know who's watching. Find a comfortable seat. If you're sitting upright, back is straight. Shoulders soft. If you prefer a lie down, your right hand on your belly, and your left on your chest. as we begin our journey together. On Monday, our meditation was about letting go of resistance. And being in a place of allowing. Basking in the energy of the sacred feminine. That quiet aspect of our mind. That quiet aspect of our soul. that we have dissolved our resistance consumed by our divine flame of love and compassion 
compassion. What word comes to you now in the silence of your mind? To replace the resistance with patience. Understanding wisdom, but when we let go of resistance, what do we have left within our hearts? What we have created is a space. To be filled with our divine essence, as we return to the source, we return to love. that it has been difficult for many, even us light workers, one rejoicing for a change of the old paradigm, tearing down the walls of separation, the barriers that keep us from unity. and love. So as these old ancient walls of resistance, fear, control, and doubt, come tumbling down to the vibration, the frequency of the Divine Feminine. We will rise again as the Great Phoenix. itself <sighs> so let's begin become a witness of your breath Moving in and moving out. Become a witness of the rise and the fall of your breath. As you begin to feel the breath move through your nostrils with the inhale, wrapping itself around your heart three times. As you hold that breath, and then slowly exhale through your mouth.
Again, feel the breath moving in through your left nostril, down the left side of your throat, through your left ribs into your heart. Feel the breath moving down your right side, the right ribs into your heart. As you hold that breath there, and slowly exhale through your mouth. Now begin to set your intention with each inhale and proclaim with each out breath. Setting an intention for yourself in today's meditation, for your healing, healing of a loved one, healing for the earth herself. Becoming the witness of your breath, the holy breath. Filling the space within your body. Moving through your organs, your bones, the blood, into the cells themselves, and into your DNA. And we learn to breathe again. We breathe in life. And we exhale all this peace. Now begin to notice four columns of lights in the corner of the room that you sit in, creating your sacred temple. Begin to see these great columns of light Move over your head six feet, anchoring in the cornerstone of higher frequency and higher vibration. Anchoring even further down below the floor of your room, anchoring into the earth's center as well extending your temple into the heart of the earth. And then you begin to see these columns of light above your head, six feet. Now these columns extend even further now, moving through our universe, the multiverses,
connecting to the great void itself, connecting to all the cosmos, into the singularity of the source. So you have created a great Merkaba, a chamber of light that is connected to the earth and the mother's heart. And connected to the great father, the source. And as you sit in this great temple, this chamber of light, you begin to feel the floor beneath you dissolve away. feel the ceiling above you, the space above you, moving into infinity and beyond. The walls of the room dissolve. So you begin to float, weightless, within this chamber. Moving your body to the left, to the right, feeling the rotation, the spinning. Of this energy as it moves through your body. begin to lose all sense of space itself. As you become as expansive as all the multiverses around you, all the soul systems and as you look above you within this chamber of light frequency and sound You begin to see all the stars, the great suns of all the universes through all timelines, through all dimensions, shine down. Upon your crystallized body,
and then these stars, like shooting stars at night. Begin to fall from the great void. Filling up this chamber that you sit in. This sacred temple. You begin to see these stars move within the space all around you. You begin to see these stars, these shooting stars, move through the top of your head. through your skin, your arms and your legs. Through your belly button, your lower back. Into your feet. And into your hands. begin to feel this great surge of energy. Moving through you now. Energy brought to you from these stars shooting down. from all the multiverses, from all the suns. Activating your crystallized body, your crystallized DNA. You begin to feel this energy surge within your belly button moving up, down through your arms, into your palm, through your fingertips. And each of these stars themselves represent scattered aspects of your souls. Experiencing multiple timelines, multiple dimensions, multiple realities. And as each of these stars fill the space inside your body, feel the space in between the organs to your blood. to the bones, and finally into your very DNA of your body, merging your crystallized multi-strand DNA 
with your human strand merging them together and you begin to feel all the stars come together merging meeting to the center of your divine heart As these stars move into your hearts, filling the space that is emptied since you let go and dissolved our resistance, all doubt fear filling this empty space now with divine love patience, understanding, and strength. To do what is meant to be done. Begin to feel that each of these stars themselves that represent a scattered aspect of your soul, of your psyche, they return home to you now, home to your heart. They return back to love. They return home to love. To your divine heart. Your multi-dimensional heart. A heart that is integrated by the divine feminine the divine masculine woven together. An integration into wholeness, into well-being.
And as we fill our divine hearts with all the souls of all our lives, past, present, and future, we release all karma. We release all ancestral lineage, all old wounds. For each star ignites our passion for life. our respect for each other, our own self-love. Love for others. And love for the earth. Begin to feel each star move into the flame of your heart now. Bringing with it its own codes of healing, knowledge, compassion, wisdom and as each star moves deeper into this great flame this great sun within your own heart you begin to feel a return to love A return to the singularity, to the source itself. Before time, before space, we return back to singularity because in the center now, within our divine heart, within our sun, With the codes of all the stars. That have filled space within the chambers. Of our multidimensional heart. We begin to see a. Vortex. A portal open. A stargate. Filled, etched with our own divine light language, our light songs. This ancient portal opens wider now. And as we look through this portal, we see thousands and thousands upon stars, solar systems, worlds. Deep within the blackness of this portal, we see the star systems 
of all dimensions. And we slowly float through, moving And as we move through this portal, we begin to feel ourselves elongate, rise like the great phoenix. We begin to see and feel the stars move by faster and faster as we speed up, moving through this space through this grid. Moving faster and faster still. We move through the cosmic web, the grid of this earth the grid of this dimension into higher dimensions as we anchor into the fifth, sixth, seventh, and here within the seventh dimension. We see different planets, different solar systems, different stars and moons. And the stars that have collected within the center of our sun, of our heart, here in this space, begins to vibrate, sending out signals echoing the signature of our soul, our oversoul. And these signals that are being sent out from the stars within our own heart, we begin to see how they vibrate and move this seventh dimensional grid. We begin to see how we open our heart, how we affect time and space. For we are time and space. We are all the stars of all the solar systems through all the timelines and dimensions collected here now in this perfect moment. And we move further still now, past all grids, all timelines, into the great void once again, the blackness that is everything, before all time, before all space, we return to the singular, source of all life. To the Father, the Creator, Here in this great void, we 
receive light codes of our original being as part of the whole as children of God we return home Allow yourself to be in this moment, floating within the void, connected to the singular source, a great beacon of light. A great, great, great sun. A light so bright that we cannot look upon it, but we feel the heat, the light, we feel the vibration and the frequency move through our heart, connected to all the stars. that we have consumed in our own sun within our divine hearts. So we become everything and we become nothing. We become all the stars and we become that singular point. We are home. We have returned to love. We have returned to the singular point of all creation. never to be the same again. Change from the DNA through our bones and our blood, change through our organs, through our skin. We are luminous beings. And our skin is only the container that holds this divine spark. It is being transmuted, transformed. For you are the light showers. The way show us. The stars within the sun of your heart becomes a beacon for others to find their way home, to find the return to their own divine love within the sun of their heart. You become their beacon as you shine. That is your purpose, to shine the love of God. In the most challenging times, the most joyful times, let 
go of resistance, the narrative, the stories, they no longer serve you. They no longer serve you. Change is here. You are prepared. You are ready. For all the stars of all the universes now are contained within the sun of your own heart, connected to the singular source of God. A great seed planted Feel the seed grow. Feel the light move through your body. Feel the love saturate your heart. As you float into the space, this perfect moment. Seeing the multiverses fly by you, the stars, the suns, the moons.
floating backwards. You begin to move, you begin to feel the wings behind your back open as you begin to soar down. The great phoenix. You slow, slowly move back, seeing our universe, our sun, our earth, our moons. And as you move closer to earth itself, moving through the sky, you begin to see a great signal, a great beacon of light that calls you home. And you follow that light, that beacon, as it brings you back into the room, back within your chamber of light. And you begin to sense the space all around you here in this space the walls around you. The floor beneath you. And the ceiling above. And you begin to see in the center of your chest this great portal etched with light language ancient gold. And you move with your mind's eye into the center of this portal, returning to home, returning back to love, back into the center of your heart, within your physical body. You have returned home to love. You have brought the singular, the source, home to rest in the sun of your heart, nourishing the seed of vibration and frequency of God, echoed through your heart, through your breath, shining through your eyes, spoken through your words, shown through your actions. But it is your time to be that signal, that beacon to shine to others in their time of need in this great time of need. Spread the news of truth, of love. Honor your neighbor. Tear down any walls. For we are one. We all return home to the singular. We are all echoes of the great divine God, Goddess.
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be. You can slowly open your eyes. Become the witness once again to your breath and the rise and fall of your chest. Thank you, Steve, Frank, Lee, and Gracie for taking the journey with me today. Share the watch party, this video, to all that you love. And I will see you Friday at 444, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Lots of love, Kelly from the Divine Hive. Be well. Talk soon.